Right now, these ducks are a mile and a half away from their home in Blue Springs. That's due to the current ordinance that prohibits hens and ducks in yards. But there's one group now trying to change that. Jen Klein has four ducks that are now living just outside of Blue Springs city limits after she found out they were prohibited per a city ordinance, an ordinance which she says she was unaware of. <laughs> Klein says she treats these ducks as if they were her own children which is why she and other residents have organized to change the current rules. The ordinance that we have written excludes roosters and drakes. So no roosters are going to be allowed. That's one concern that a lot of people, you know, that we hear from a lot of people. Um, so no roosters, up to six hens. The hens have to be contained inside their coop. During the day, they're not allowed to free range. So we won't have a bunch of animals at large, which is another concern. Amanda Ramirez is one of the group members getting petition signatures. She wants to have chickens for sustainability for her family, among other purposes. They are eco-friendly, so they eat your food scraps. They also um, eat all of the nasty bugs that we don't like, like mosquitoes and ticks. Um, so it reduces that bug population um, within the city without having to use harmful pesticides. It also lets us know as citizens where our food's coming from. Yeah, At a September that, City Council meeting, the city issue. instructed staff uh, to write up a new me, ordinance for consideration. This... Blue Springs is one of the few cities in Jackson County that does not already allow hens or ducks. But some residents don't want that to change. I don't want to see them, smell them, hear them. You know, I, I didn't move next to a golf course to have chickens in my neighbor's backyard. I would just hope that they're going to be responsible, you know, whoever gets it, if it does pass. Ramirez and Klein argued that the animals have a minimal smell and are fairly quiet, comparing them to a dog barking. For now, the group works to get 3,500 residents on board for their cause. Reporting in Blue Springs, Claire Bradshaw, KSHB 41 News.